Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to look at this newer metal cage for Osmo Action. I bought it on Amazon. When I bought it, there was a slight discount. Uh, it ended up costing me around 30 bucks. The reason I bought this cage was because I recently picked up the Osmo, Osmo Action 4. So even though this is branded or sold as a, a cage for Osmo Action 3, but the body does not change from 3 to 4. So this would apply to this device just as fine. Now, Osmo Action, when they ship out, it comes in with manufacturing or this uh, OEM cage made by DJI. It offers sufficient protection, even though this is plastic, but it's very well made. However, since I want to use an external mic, uh, with the, the uh, DJI and I couldn't do that with this case because it doesn't have a cold shoe mount and that's why I pick up this one which has a cold shoe mount on the top the cage is very well made uh, it's made of solid aluminum it's got a button here you can press it and it open the cage and then you can slide in the action camera just like that um, and then you can close it it'll lock uh, so it's got a, a button here that trend that connect to the button on camera and it's got a cold shoe mount these are the cutout for the audio holes and uh, on the side it got cut out for the uh, recording buttons and also for the USB-C port you can remove the door of the USB-C port so that you can plug in your mic or whatever accessories you want to use with that and on the bottom, it's got a cutout for the mount uh, of the DJI. And on the side, it's got the, uh, the quick release mount um, that you can attach to. And essentially, uh, you can use it for, for vertical shooting. Um, and it's got a couple holdouts. Uh, it's got a quarter inch screw holes for you to mount additional accessory. So overall, the quality is good, uh, material is solid, um, it will offer adequate protection for the camera. However, this cage also has a couple of, I think, drawbacks uh, that uh, wasn't really carefully sought out when they designed it. Uh, first, of is, first of which is when you open the side panel, uh, here you see this doesn't fully open, which is fine. But the real problem is they left a hook here, uh, you can see it from this angle, that really will block uh, because this is a side door of the action camera and because of the hook you can't really open it uh, because this will block. The only way to open is you have to push out the camera, push it out a little bit like this and then you're able to sl slide the door and uh, have access to the battery and memory card um, and the other thing is because it's um, it, it's fixed on this end so it's kind of uh, difficult to move in and out uh, the camera because the cage has a, a, a strip of rubber sticker on the on the bottom so the friction is uh, makes it a bit hard to move it in and out. That's why this hook is even more annoying because every time you want to just change battery or uh, you know, take your footage out of the camera, it's a pain in the butt to, to do that um, with this hook. Um, so overall, I, I probably will return it. Uh, because of the design flaw, because I already found another pro product um, that's, I think, more uh, a, a better design that allow you to kind of change battery and the uh, memory card on the go, um, which I would you know, reveal later once I got it. So that's about it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.